Happy May 16th. I'd say it's about time to get going. You pretty girl. Dirty. Yep. Time to get going. Well, I'm excited to say that I'm going. I, uh, you can't see anything. It's super, uh, <laughs> it's dusty. It's, I mean, especially where I just chiseled the end rows last Wednesday, but, uh, yeah, I had a, had a little bit, got 10, 10 feet into the field and, uh, had a hose blow on the, uh, the rolling basket back there. But thankfully, uh, there was a local place that fixes hydraulic hoses, so it was an easy one to get out and get off and they just spliced, uh, put a splice in it and back at it. So right now I'm doing the outer boundary. I'm being uh, lazy and, and letting the, uh, the boundary track drive for me. So <laughs> just doing this. Uh, slowly but surely that's going up, up to 8.7 acres per hour. I know people have said before, what do, I, what do I got this monitor going in? Like all these monitors. It's my planner monitor. This is the Integra. It's just, it will be there for spring, but for right now I just like it because it gives me statistics of oh, how much I've done. I can just look at the field, but, and then obviously the 4600, that, that's pretty important. Uh, so I don't actually have to do anything, but it's not that I don't do anything, it's that I actually have some more time to, uh, let's see. So, there are portions that I forget to pick up sometime where if it gives a little icon, it's saying the curve is too sharp and to take over. But sometimes I remember that, sometimes I don't. But it's a beautiful day. Today is uh, today and tomorrow. It's uh, it's what I gotta do. So, uh, however long long I need to work for, um, it's just gotta get done. Uh, I'm, I I think it's doable. Um, the 8.7 acres per hour. For some reason, I was thinking this uh, this was slightly uh, <laughs> we'd go a little bit faster with the field elevator, but. We'll see once I start going back and forth. But I already got dirty uh, for the day because of that hydraulic hose, so never fails. But a little less than I am. Actually, drive. <laughs> the condition oh. wasn't that it was wet. I just I needed to turn and slightly adjust the the depth. Um, because I hadn't worked through that, so uh, it was a little bit more compact. But yeah, I'll say I'm I'm liking this field cultivator. Uh, maybe I'll do a video just on it. But you know, to me, it looks like it's uh, the shanks are staying in the ground compared to the, the Case IH with the fiber shank design. So we'll see how it continues with that, but. I'm happy. So I may go one more round the field because uh, let's 
sheet. So this is 30 and 30, so 60. I typically will do two planner passes, so 32 rows. So probably should do one more. But if I do one more, then I'm on the uh, going crossways. So maybe not. We'll see. <laughs> it's nice when you can just get going down and back and forth, back and forth. Keep going. Got a lot to do today and tomorrow. 150 acres, hopefully. So definitely more blessed than I should be because that's my mom picking up rocks for me. This root field is, there's a ton of rocks, but I'm so thankful that she's able to do that for me while I can be field cultivating. And you need to do a parts pickup. <laughs> see, is it here? Huh. Okay. Found it. <laughs> it was right there. When you lose a cover. stays on this time. And there it is. $500 later. <laughs> Come and get the box later. It's time to call it a day. It's uh, 12.50 in the morning. It's a little long of a day, but got it all, got it all field cultivated, so I guess I'll be planting today. Should have probably been tomorrow if I would have finished soon enough, but yeah. Go get some sleep. It'll be good. Planting.